taken a whole lot of effort but i am so so proud of this build and and also of this terraforming right look at this i don't know if you noticed right back at the start of that clip but i did like stuff everything's gone from over there this is all flattened out this is just oh this is i i love this i'm proud of this this is this is everything that I wanted it to be. Those of you that have been watching me on Twitch, uh, you know, we, we, we spent a bit of time building this in creative and and trying to get the aesthetic right. But, man, I am I am so, so thrilled with this. Let's go and have a quick look inside and I'll show you around. All right. So you know all the mechanics. We've, we've done all the work on getting the mechanics working. Uh, you've seen most of the rooms before and what is next is actually getting all of the all of the interior decoration done right um we've got a, there are there are a couple of rooms where we've been doing a bit of work already oh the study is starting to come together we've got some statues in the corner it's hard to do an angled desk but we've we've tried right uh the red couches that are in this room but there are a couple of things that there are a couple of things we haven't spoken about yet, and that is in the game, you are able to move between the corner rooms without any hindrance. You get a free pass between the rooms. You don't have to roll the dice. You can just announce that you're moving to the rooms. So we need to put in the secret passages, right? There's got to be a passage from here to the conservatory all the way up here. Hello? Hello? I hate that you can't, Bob... You, you can't quite. You, uh, anyway, hello, uh, and then and then from the kitchen, yes, from the kitchen, and we know those of you that know the movie know what happens here. <laughs> uh, well, there's from the kitchen over to the study in the other corner. So I think we're going to start working on those. Okay, so this is where uh, I want to get one of the doorways in, and what I want this to be. Hmm. Oh, we're getting to see behind the curtain here. Woohoo! Look at that. Hey, should we ring the bell? <laughs> uh, okay, so down here. Yes. Okay, this is going to be uh this is going to be where one of the secret passageways uh, comes through and this is going to be connected to the kitchen. And I think what we'll do is 
Hmm. We'll have to go downstairs. Uh, let me show you where the kitchen one will be. We might go and put this one in and then work on the alignment of the other secret passage. Because you can't crisscross secret passages because then they run into each other. Uh-oh. Uh I broke a thing. Boop. There we go. Uh, oh, my pockets are full. Huh. That's better. Okay. So uh, this, I think, will be... Ah. Right. Um, well... <laughs> Okay, well, you haven't seen, um, this is the, oh, well, now you've, this is the secret tradesman's entrance. Oh, uh, oh, I'm falling down the ladder. Um, okay, ah, stop! All right, um, whew, right, I just get myself under control. All right, I'm gonna have to move this then. This is where I've been napping while I've been building the house. I've been down in here a gazillion times while making the video you've just seen. <laughs> I wasn't expecting... Okay. All right. Uh, let's move this. Actually, I don't have to move it. This is perfect because... Uh, uh oh I left... <sighs> I emptied my inventory, but now I need my inventory. Hang on. The... Uh-oh. Uh, okay. I do have to move this. It's in the way at the moment. Um, right. So this is going to be where the walkway... The walkway comes through, uh, and I think if we think about this, uh oh, hang on, there we go. If we think about this, yeah, I think I want it to be three high so you can do a little bit of a hoppy run through it all. So let's get this down to here, and then here, and I think. Ooh, we've got a lot of redstone we've got to clear as well, right? And we've got to get over there. Oh, no, this will be right. This can go all the way along there. Yes. Yes, I've got this worked out. Okay, all right. Uh, let me lay some blocks this way. All right, I'll go get my blocks and we'll, we'll put some down. Okay, this is... Oh, no, this is going to block my tradesman's entrance. <laughs> Oh, no. Man, I tell you what, Indy has just been on the server and could see me having my service entrance struggles, and he's been an absolute genius. I hadn't put a toilet in this bathroom yet, and in fact, I could still put a little basin here, but I'll put a sign on this to say it's 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 staff only, but look at this. There's a secret entrance here now to get down. Oh, I've done it again. Oh, man, I keep falling off the ladder. Uh, it, <laughs> this is brilliant. This is absolute just genius. Uh, it's a, it's even using. I'm not gonna even look. I maybe Indy can come over sometime and and show you and um uh, uh explain what's going on. But uh, it, he's using a copper block as a t flip flop for those of you that redstone for Kate and know what that means. Uh, but that is awesome. Okay, we've got to now go and re and uh, and have a look at this other secret passage. I kind of want it to be in the middle here, but ah, hello, we found another one of these. Um, but I'm a little bit worried. So we want to make a little fireplace here, and yeah. I thought that might be the case. There's a thing right there. So, no, it's not going to be there uh, this time. We can probably get away with it being... Oh, well, the fireplace can be over here then. That's all right. And then that will be the... <laughs> oh, no, but I can't do it right there because of that one. Oh, uh, uh, <laughs> um, uh, okay, let's... All right, sorry, wall. We, we'll fix you up soon. We've got to work this out. Because we need... Oh, hang on. Hang on. Here. Wait. Here will work. Because... Uh, okay, hang on. We'll go down here. Oh, made it. Look at that. Okay, so in the middle might work right here. Because... Uh, no. Oh. Uh, my pockets are full again. Oh, I tell you what. These pockets of mine... Sorry, Doctor. I, look, I get, we need to talk about the aneurysm I had yesterday. Yeah, what were you doing before that? I was streaming and my pockets were full. Okay, so I think I've got this worked out. I think this might actually work. Uh, keep going. More. Okay, I think this might work. I think uh, I'm going to do cracked and not cracked on the walls. 
and then maybe the floor and the ceiling with polished. Uh, hello. That was too many of them. Now that's not enough of them. Richard! Okay, uh, so if we dangle out the side here. Oh, actually, well, the hearth for the fireplace, I think we'll do stone. So, and I think once you're through the trapdoor, yeah, once once you're down here, this can be the, yes, hop. This is actually going to work perfectly. There's just the right amount of space here. Um, just the right, ah, just the right amount of space here to go in there. Uh, one more and perfect. And of course, I need to work out where the other spot's going to come out. So I'm hoping that... Uh oh What did I break? Uh, this should... Did I... Is that... Uh-oh. Did I... I don't think I broke something important then. Uh-oh. Let's go have a look. Uh oh Oh, <laughs> my ankles again. Um... No, no, I think that's okay. I think that was a bit of test ground that I was working on. Uh, so that's okay. It's just, is that? Yeah, it's on the, um, uh, hang on. Uh, okay, I've made it. Right, so uh, that was perfect. Well, now it doesn't need to be this high, but uh, we can, uh, ooh, yeah. Okay, I think that's going to be too close because we can't do the... Okay, we've got to go across one. Yep. Okay, that's where it's going to be. What a mess. <laughs> what? A stupid bats. Okay. Um. So, yep. 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 Okay. Well, that's all right. We can come across from the other direction now and uh, we should be able to line up perfectly with this and, uh, and we should be able to finish it up. Okay. Look at that. All right, there we go. I've made it. I'm amazing. Oh, man. Okay, so I might have got the alignment sli <laughs> slightly wrong on this one. <laughs> it's okay, though, um, because at least at least I've made it. I totally haven't fallen off any scaffolding or anything like that at all during this build. It's fine. <clears throat> okay. Oh, all the way down. Okay. All right, listen, I'm just about done with this build. Can we hurry up and play this game already? Stupid bats! Well, I have got all of the secret passages done and uh, I've been doing a little bit more decorating around the house. I'll show you that in just a moment. Uh, I was watching a movie last night and just thought I'd do a little bit of decorating while the movie was on. Um, okay, so this is one of the entrances. Uh, isn't that tricky? Uh, this, oh, I could put a sign in these, maybe. This one is to the kitchen. Uh, I love... You know, you think this one looks sort of gloomy. I guess, yeah, I wish there was more variations in the brick blocks. That would be, that'd be really cool. Obviously, this is the, this is the vanilla tweaks things. This might look a bit weird to everyone else who isn't running the, the vanilla tweaks resource pack. But anyway, um, this is the cupboard, uh, in the kitchen, uh, the pantry, I think. Actually, is it the, Fridge in the movie? Ooh, ooh, might need to go check myself there. A uh, couple of more decorations around. Uh, I think since you were last year, I set up the... Ah, yes, that's right. Didn't have the right... Um, okay, <laughs> ignore that for a second. Uh, we've got, we've got, we've got stuff in here. Uh, I've done some copper work. Uh, so we've got the copper chairs in there. Uh, oh, the fireplace. Okay. Oh, no, hang on. No, wait. Uh, um, uh, uh, the other tunnel. Of course. Ha, huh, daytime. Go. <laughs> uh, this is the other one, and this has now worked out really well. Gosh, that was chaotic starting to build these. We, those little clips that you saw came from a Twitch stream. I'm not streaming at the moment, and I'm far more relaxed. <laughs> um, but if you ever want to see what I get up to on stream, come across and... Uh, Twitch.tv slash uh, Richard Thornton. I'm considering streaming on YouTube at some point soon. Never done it. Uh, might. Hey, that's a weird effect. Ooh, that's weird. Um, I might do it. I don't know. We'll see. And then you come out the four. Fo oh, yeah, that's right. you got to do a little bit of. Oh, uh, no. What have I done? Oh, no. Yeah. Hmm. You've got to squat. It's a bit tricky, but it's a secret passage, right? You've got to kind of shift and jump at the same time. To that's okay. People can work that out. Uh, but that there. Hmm, I feel like that should be recessed 
one block. Maybe I'll try that. It's just a bit flat, that's all. Uh, done a bit of decorating in here too, so it's a little bit more exciting. Um, I'm still not super sold on the yellow. I'm planning right at the end of this episode, if you stick around, uh, I want to show some of the um, reference shots from the movie that I've used to design these rooms. Uh, some of the, just quickly, some of the other um, decorations I've done. We've got some furniture in here now. It's all very dark, but as you'll see in the reference shots, it's quite dark. We've got the head database. Um, I'm loving these. I think these are great. Different size books around. If, look, if anyone's got any ideas, maybe actually, do I have any on me? Oh, I do. I wonder if, you know what? Yes. Yes, I don't have enough on me, but uh, I don't know what to do with that wall then. But maybe, maybe we leave the end open. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I like that. Just adds a bit of texture to the walls. Excellent. And I can do there and there and not there. Hmm. That's okay. Uh, I'll work that out. Yeah. Well, oh, no. No. I uh, might have to move all these across one side. Okay, all right. And the dining room. I love this dining room. There are some really intricate um, designs around the walls. That's the best reference I can do to it because otherwise it starts to get a bit crazy. Uh, in here, we've got the fireplace. I'm on the table. We've got a fireplace. Uh, and I'll show you outside as well. Uh, but one thing I do want to do is to pop a few um, candles around as well, and light them up. I think that, oh! <laughs> don't want to set off the sprinkler system. Uh, I don't think houses this old had sprinkler systems. Um, I think, well, we can find a few spots. Oh, wow, yeah, okay, let me show you this one. Uh, the piece de resistance, yes, and they're weathering finally too. In the movie, they've got a green grand piano, and so I've done this. This is, this is my, Homage to the, uh, I say homage a lot. This is my, this is my homage to, uh, to the thing. Can I not? Hello? Oh, oh, okay. Oh, that's annoying the tall ones at the front there. But that's okay. Oh, I like that. And, ah, uh, ah, uh, um, uh, oh, well, like this. <gasps> this will look cool from outside. Um, a boop boop. This would also set fire to the curtains that they have in the movie, but they fall there. Uh, that's okay. <laughs> this is, what is it? An homage. Okay. Hey, listen. Now, right. Uh, we've got to go. We're going to take a break from the house just for a second. Um, the Nether Tunnel. If you remember last episode, which was only about eight years ago that I published that, um, we're working on the Noon Balloon Nether Tunnel. And I've got another little build to show you from over there, the second panel of that. And then don't leave because there's one more custom thing. I don't want to give it away yet. Custom thing that I've built for this game that I think takes it up just one more notch. is this I I really I love the story that it well I mean I love the book this is the thing this this book is just fabulous and we're gonna have the whole story told through here uh the kids are in the bedroom and then they take flight and the first place that they pass on their journey is the forest uh flying over the forest with the mermaids in the water nearby and I love I love this I love love what I've done here so uh, next episode, we'll get to see the next panel of, uh, of this book. There's not much else I can show you uh, around here yet. I have not done any work at all. <laughs> any work at all on what has been my base. I've actually been considering moving into the base of the Clue Mansion, but, uh, there are, there are other projects that I'm going to work on over there. Um, so it would make sense having... 
uh, everything I own <laughs> underground. I'm just going to become a hermit. Not that kind of hermit. Jeepers. Before we go back inside, I have to say a massive, massive thank you to the people whose names you see on the screen at the moment. Uh, my Patreon subscriptions have been up for a little while now, and we have recently launched Stagecraft, which is my uh, community SMP uh, Minecraft. It's a vanilla-adjacent, mostly vanilla, Minecraft survival server on Java Edition, and we are having an absolute ball. Uh, some of the builds um, are something to be seen. I'm astonished by what I'm seeing on that server. But honestly, thank you so much. If you'd like to join us or if you'd just like to support me and the creative endeavours that I am undertaking, uh, I would absolutely love it and appreciate it so much if you would consider signing up to my Patreon. Now, there is one aspect of this game we have not talked about at all yet. Have you worked out what it is? Ah, oh, those of you that have watched me on Twitch know exactly what it is. But it is the note-taking component of the game. So remember, when you start the game, you will be dealt uh, a handful of cards. And so you, of course, immediately know that they are not part of the solution, what which is hidden down in the cupboard down there. And your job is to work out what the solution is by... Asking questions of other players and working out what cards they have. And there's a process to it. There is a number system that is kind of recognized as one of the, I don't know, like main systems that people will use in Cluedo. But, but it's not absolutely not necessary. Like it's it, that's a, a far more advanced way of... Uh, trying to determine who has what. I think we need Bunny in here because in one of the test games we did, Bunny worked it out too quickly. I don't know. Something about that woman worries me. She knows too much. Anyway, listen, what I didn't want people to have to do is to keep a notepad on their desk. And when you buy the board game, you're given little pieces of paper and it will have a spot for each of the people, the who, the weapons, the what, and the rooms, the where, right? And and you cross them off. So if you're given, I don't know, Colonel Mustard with the dagger in the, in the billiard room, then you cross them off uh, both in the column that is like your final solution column and you tick them off in yours and you can also then cross them off for the other players because you know that those players don't have uh, the cards that you've got. I looked at using notebook uh, books, but they were painful because you had to flip through pages and it was just crazy. I looked at trying to use a like a data pack and doing it all in text commands and it was a nightmare. I needed something visual. So yeah, da, 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 let me present to you the Cluecraft scoring system or note-taking system. And this is it. So if you are dealt well, okay, hang on. Boom, there we go. Okay, so let's be player one and uh, let's have a look at this here, right? So um, I've got Miss Scarlet and Colonel Mustard. So I would go in here and I would say, I've got Scarlet and I've got Mustard, which means they cannot be, they cannot be the final solution, right? Uh, I've also got the revolver and the conservatory and billiard room. So revolver. Uh, conservatory, a boop, boop, and billiard room, boop, boop, and that can't be in the solution. Now, there is a lot of clicking, right? It, 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 there's, a, there's a bit you're going to have to do, and there are some shortcuts I've considered making, uh, which would be if you put a yes uh, in that column, it would potentially block off uh, any, uh, anyone else's cards, and if you put a Yes, in here, it would do the same sort of thing, obviously. Right. Uh, yeah. So um, that's th this is what you can use. So during the game, you might ask another player uh, or make a suggestion that uh, it was, I don't know, um, Professor Plum in, well, you got to work out how you're going to do it. You might be in the conservatory and you might say, I think it was Professor Plum in the conservatory with the revolver. And of course, you're hoping to get Professor Plum. And if player three then showed you Professor Plum, 
uh, you would put that in there and cross that off as another likely person. We might need other states as well. I don't know. I don't know. But this seemed to me to be the most uh, accessible way for people to do it. It does require a mod and uh, a certain config file. There's no super easy way to do this unless you're making your own mod pack or something, which I don't want to do. Uh, I'm using a mod called Fancy Menu. And for the alphas... Uh, I'll in Discord link uh, just a, a, the one step you need to do to unzip the config files and chuck them in your Minecraft folder as well. But I'll tell you what, the little bit of work that's required to get this uh, into the game uh, to, to do the notes while you're playing, I reckon it's worth it. Well, I've been putting a few more decorations around. There's some paintings upstairs, uh, paintings on these walls. Um, uh, hey, uh, no. Thank you. Uh, oh, it was night time. Um, there's a few. It'd be nice to have a few more vertical ones. I think that's a bit too bright. Um, I'm trying not to use reuse things too much. Uh, <clears throat> too much, but I like them. I think they're nice. So that one's good. That suits the decor of the house very well. That one, not so much, but that's okay. Listen, there's one more thing I want to do this week before we get out of here. And that is throw together uh, a billiard table. Uh-oh. Uh, you know, that's okay. I think we can... I think that's about the size we want in here. It doesn't... Yeah. Uh, and there's... Uh-oh. No. No. Uh, okay. Ah, got it. Um, There is a trick to... Uh, putting a cue on the billiard table, and it goes a little bit like that. Uh, and then I think if we put... No, not there. That's not the spot we want it. Uh, if we put green carpet all the way around, and I think we can then do it on the edges over there, and... Hmm, it overhangs a little bit, but you know what? I think that... Oh, and I can even climb on. Oh, and I sink into it. Right. I think... Oh, sorry, don't mind me. I'm just standing on the table again. Uh, I think that's what I want to do. Yeah, that gives a little bit more room to move around in here. Yeah, that's much better. I like that. And, of course, this is all for decoration, right? None of this is integral to the game at all, but it's just because I'm a nerd and I like building things that, that, that match other things. And, oh, man, I, this is, this is, is that it? Is that actually, is that, oh, was, these still need to be weathered a bit. Ah, oh, but you can see now. Right, it's all coming together. The green piano's working. We've got stuff in here. Indy's going to do his magic on the trees outside ah now um i'm going to show you in just a second the shot of this room i put all the chairs around the table because that's just the way i thought i'd lay out the room but no there's only six guests for dinner uh one two three four five six very clever in the scene in the movie uh you'll see the shot sort of from about here uh ah oh i haven't lit the candles uh, they've, they've obviously taken a couple of tables away, uh, chairs away from the table, which is fantastic. Um, I like that. That's looking good. And then the kitchen. Oh, I think we are just about there. Yeah, that we don't need to worry about that wall. Uh, I put this in actually, and you'll see in just a second. Um, that's a bit of a, dare I say, homage. Um, <laughs> To, to the uh, cooktop that's that's in the movie. Uh, I've put legs on the table. Unfortunately, they... Is it the debug stick? I remember B-dubs talking about changing, like, the angles of things. Uh, someone... Give, 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 I need... All right, B-dubs, help. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. I don't know. Can I stop that? For, I don't think I can stop that from happening. Um... Just, I thought I'd just, that's my little nod to the building process. I've just tucked my little, that's just me being silly up there. Um, cup of tea, love. <laughs> and sinks. I put in the sinks. All right. I think that's it. I think that's it, folks. I think we're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. This is the Clue Mansion and I've finished. 
I've, well, okay. One last thing I've got to do, which I'm not going to do now, and that is the driveway out here. I've got to put a little bit of a uh, balcony, not a balcony, I don't know, a, a thing, um, a porch here with a couple of dogs, for those of you that know the movie, and there will be a garage over here and the circular driveway, but uh, there's the chimney cooking up a storm over there. I, I'm done. This is it, folks. This is it. The very next video that you're going to see from me on this channel is an instructional video on how to play this game, uh, which I'm pretty sure everyone's going to work out, but there's a few little things like using the tab list to work out uh, the order of the players and stuff, and uh, the two-player variant of the game, which I'll talk about in that video as well. <sighs> I'm done. Such a weird feeling, you know? <laughs> I have spent so, so long working on this thing, and I just, I don't know. I, 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 I ah, there's, there's a lot. There's, there's a lot that we've done. Um, oh, look at that. There's still some dirt up there. I'm not going to touch that. I think that might break things. We're done. We're done. That's it. We're done. We're done. We're done. I'm going to... Ah, yes. I do have to <clears throat> clean that up. <sighs> I'm going to the gym. That's it. I hope you've enjoyed this video, folks. And I hope you're looking forward to seeing some of us alphas play... Uh, a few games of this. We'll probably do that on streams, I imagine. Uh, it's a very slow, thoughtful game that doesn't have a lot of activity. We might be able to make some highlight videos or something from this. But you know what? I am going to love you and leave you. Thank you so much for all of your support on this channel. Thank you to the patrons. Oh, thank you to those of you that have been joining me on the streams as we crash our way <laughs> through what is... Now, bigger than Rich Mart was, which that at the time was the biggest thing I'd ever done. This now, by far, uh, that Rich Mart pales into insignificance. I will see you all in the very next video, which will hopefully be much sooner than this one was. I'll see you later, folks. Thank you. Goodbye.